This lady is out for a stroll. But wait, who is this lurking behind a nearby tree? She was prepared for the attack because she stayed alert. These gentlemen did not stay alert. See what happens. Stay alert. Stay alert. Stay alert. Stay alert. Stay alert. This pithy fellow is off to see mum and dad flouting the one parent rule. But wait, his neighbour has stayed alert and will stop him in his tracks. Control the virus. This lady is planning to hide from the virus by making a dress out of curtain material. And don't worry, your government is working hard on the vaccine. How's it going, Bill? Oh, back to the drawing board. Oh, what's this? These spinny young ladies are making protective equipment. A bit on the large side, eh, girls? And who's this? It's our old friend, the man they call Mr. Hancock, Mr. Matt Hancock. No doubt overseeing the workers and reminding them to watch their tone. He's taking no chances. This ingenious fellow has made a mask to protect his horse, Mr. Rag and Bone. Now if you're stuck inside for long periods of time and need a break from the kiddies, let them play in a loosely secured cage hanging out of a seven-story window. Then you can enjoy some gin, a cigarette, and a nice game of whist. And don't forget to exercise. Jeremy here isn't letting lockdown get the better of him, although his dicky ticker may be another story. Or exercise right before bed in your gym jams the whole family can join in. Or half naked in front of the mirror with your small dog. Alice here is exercising with her stepbrother, which is completely appropriate. Save lives! Hey you! Hey! Hey you! Come here you! Don't you know there's a virus on the loose? Obey the slogans! Coughs and sneezes spread diseases. Don't touch your virus, you might catch a virus. I'll leave you with wise words from the man they call Mr. Wisdom, Mr. Harry Wisdom. The best way you can help is by rationing yourselves. I'm sure that all of you will buy your fair share and no more. <laughs>